Hello students, welcome to English classes and today we are starting grammar. The chapter name is the sequence of tenses. The sequence of tenses. What is meant by sequence? Sequence we can say this as order. Like when you see numerals, it comes one, two, three. This is the order. Right? We cannot change the order. 2, 4, 3, 1. We cannot change the order. So, this we call as sequence. Even in the grammar, the tense will be followed. In the sentence will be sequence. It will be in order. Okay? And you know about tenses. Present, past, future right in the types are there let's see about this principal clause and subordinate clause and i have already taught you what is meant by principal clause and subordinate clause principal clause we can say that as main clause and rest of the sentence which is attached to it it is said to be subordinate clause so if the rest of the parts of the sentence that is subordinate clause if we take it out Still, we will get the meaning. It is said to be principal clause. Okay. Next. A past tense followed by a past tense. In the tense. When a sentence starts with a past tense. And it will be followed by past tense only. But when a sentence starts with the present or future. It can be followed by all the three present, past and future. Example, you see about first sentence example. Father said, it is the past. Father said that he would be past tense. He would be late. He went to work. So he said that he would be late. Tonight he will be coming late. So it started with the past tense and his subordinate clause. It has the past tense. Right? It is the example of first. And the second example if you think Now, if you see, he think that. So, here it is of present. But here you see, past also there. He, we think that he went. That person has gone. We think that he will go. Still. And in the Zoom classes, we will learn about this in a detailed manner. Thank you.